get an idea or a theme and you dig into it and you try to understand it. And the more you uh, work with that theme, painting it, the deeper your understanding becomes. It's also often a political or social statement. You want to start a discussion. You want to get people thinking and talking. And uh, to me, that's very important. And it's also about therapy, art therapy. It's very therapeutic. If you have a transition, if you want to understand something about yourself, art is just the best possible way to inquire to dig deeper. And this show is about all of that. If you've had a chance to read some of the uh, plaques, for want of a better word, uh, it's a pretty simple thing. This show wonders why a society that aspires to balancing female and male energy, the Jungian anima animus, or the yin yang, why that same society has so much trouble with people that are born that way, that aren't black or white, not male or female, but somewhere along the scale. And so this wall behind me is all about the Jungian philosophy and the yin yang and the concept of balance at the end. This wall over here is all about how people express themselves when they're not black or white when they're somewhere along that scale. The wall over there is about when you finally have the courage to address that, especially if you feel that you never had a place. When do you say, okay, that's me. I'm prepared to take the mask off and let people have a glimpse of me. I'm prepared to climb into the cocoon and do some work see what happens at the end. And the wall on the right is what happens if you get it right. Um, you achieve balance, you achieve self-acceptance, you're free to be. And frankly, it was a joy to put this together, because in case it's not obvious, this is, this is my story. I've never been black or white from earliest memory, age two or three. I'd known I was great. The last set of comments I had to make were about thank yous, but uh, Hugh has done that beautifully. Everybody's been thanked, except a few people. Way back, it was Arm Allport and Layla who um, encouraged me to, to put in an application to say a show is possible. They, they got this started by showing some interest in me, in my story, in this theme. Along the way, there were some frustrations. Lots of things had to happen to make it actually come together. Uh, Layla, in particular, and Hugh were there in the home stretch. Simple things like labels. Ken Fraser making the balance sign. But I also want to thank uh, someone who was just casually mentioned as part of the installation crew, my partner in life, Sally, who over three years watched every one of these paintings come out of my studio in a messy, kind of half-finished way, and would offer her opinions. Uh, constructive critique always, but the critique was there. And so, I mean, she shares this life with me. And she shared the production of this show with me. And uh, I appreciate the support. I'm looking forward.